So for 10 years, you guys on every Wednesday night every Wednesday. have shown up here at Mariachi Plaza in the heart of Boyle Heights. Yeah, rain or shine. They call themselves the Boyle Heights Bridge Runners. A running club started in 2013 with a few friends who wanted to stay in shape. I always have to stop and appreciate the view every week. Crossing an iconic Los Angeles landmark that's a bridge to both the past and the future for the community of mostly Latino residents. Why did you decide to do it here? One, it's our space. And the other part is like, you have an amazing backdrop, right? Like our gym is this community. Everybody say hi to Jacob. I met up with the group's co-leader, Rolando Cruz, and the runners who travel together three miles each week over the Sixth Street Bridge. What's it like for you when you run across it? You know, this is my city, this is a community that I love. With all of its challenges and with all of its greatness and all of its flaws, I don't want to be anywhere else but here. The location was made famous in movies like Grease and Terminator 2. Then it was torn down and reopened in 2022. What was it like for you as a kid to grow up in this neighborhood? I'm a product of a single mom uh, growing up here uh, during the 80s and 90s when, you know, gang violence was at a height in Los Angeles, specifically in this community. It was super challenging. But I, I think it was a part of the reasons why I love it, because this community has overcome so much. Today, the club regularly has 60 to 100 runners who come out all year long from beginners to athletes. What's your day job? So I'm a massage therapy. Human resources. I work as a barista. I work in the clothing industry. It's easy to fall into the cycle of going home, turning on TV, eating a burger. It's a challenge to get up and say, I'm going to run three miles with strangers along the bridge and under the freeways. An area like Boyle Heights has been impacted by a lot of challenging health issues, the highest rates of diabetes, cholesterol, all of these things that uh, can affect our community. Many, including Rolando, who's finished four LA marathons, become serious runners. If you would have told me, you know, before this, I, if I would run a marathon, I would be like, you're out of your mind. When you look around today, you know, what do you see here? I see people that are every day fighting for themselves, fighting to stay afloat, fighting to provide for their families. And I know that because that's me, right? Dale gas! All right, everybody, have a great run. Let's go! The burden of the community is heavy, and to be able to provide a space for folks to let some of that pressure go and have a release that is inspiring for folks, I think has been really meaningful for me, and I think it's a testament of love. Vamos. And there are definitely some very fast runners in this group. This is what it feels like when everybody's passing you. All right, we're what? Like, third of the way? Yeah, just about. How you feeling? Oh, great. How are you feeling? I feel great. I think I feel okay. There we go. There we Good go. Side. After you. So this is a view that people don't often see. The underbelly of the It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Three more blocks. And finally, the end was in sight. I made it. Thank you. Everybody sweaty. There we go. And happy. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> love stories. And we need a lot of people. This group of people is one of the most incredible group of people that I've ever spent time around. They think it's important to give back. They often raise funds to help teachers and kids in need. They combine exercise and friendship. It is a home run for the community. And I'm just, I just want to say thank you to the Boyle Heights Bridge Runners for inviting me out. It was, yeah. uh, it was a really special experience to you be from L.A. and get to see it in that's that way. That's so cool. Yeah. That, and I didn't throw up at the end. That's, well, which is always <laughs> Always good. Hey, you're training for a half marathon, right? Yeah, you're blowing up my spot left and right on the show today. <laughs> yes, I'm trying. But Have you watched our show? Yeah, it's true. <laughs> it's and I, well, I promise not to wear tights ever again. <laughs> Oh, you're fine. Stop it. Thank you. All right. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.